Alright guys, we're back again. I got a good one for you today, something a little bit different. Um, a little while ago I ordered a kit. We had a lot of spiders on the outside of the house. I think a lot of people have this, uh, as far as I know, because a lot of people have asked me about it. So I wanted to get a spray for spiders, but I didn't want to use home defense. I wanted to get something more professional, but I didn't want to pay the professional price, because everybody knows it's like, I don't know, $600 a year. So I found this website, and I'm gonna link it below. Um, it's called Do-It-Yourself Pest Control. They're actually out of Georgia. And I ordered a kit, it cost about $100. Came into this box, and it came with this head, which is just a brush head, because it's a two-part. It's a dust that goes up in the soffits, and then there's a spray that goes along the bottom of the house all the way around the perimeter. So they gave me this bottle, which you fill up with the, and it's pressurized for spraying. I got that head for dusting and then it comes with this bottle of uh, defense dust insecticide if you can see it and then it comes with this which is the uh, liquid mix for the spray okay most that's defense too SC it's called so the whole kit was a hundred bucks came in one package so it was real nice and simple and this is actually I think this is the third year I'm going to use it or the fourth year I'm going to use it and I don't know if you can see in the camera or not but I still have a half a bottle left and I still have a lot of dust left too. So actually for $100, I got uh, probably four or five years worth of, and I do it twice a year. And for my house, it takes about two to two and a half of the spray bottles, um, which is only like, this is a squeeze bottle. So you just fill this cap up here and then you pour it out. But this stuff works great. Ever since I started using it, I haven't seen spiders at all. I just do it in the spring when the winter breaks and I do it in the fall right before winter and it keeps all the spiders away. So. I'm gonna show you how you do it. I'll link it in the description if anybody's interested in doing. Um, all you need is a mask. Um, I have the fancy mask, but you could just use a regular, you know, one of the, like the doctor's type masks if you wanted. I just happen to have this from painting and stuff like that. So I use this, some goggles, and we're just gonna, I'll show you how we mix it up real simple. I mean, it takes about 30, 40 minutes for my house. We'll just go around and dust all the soffits and uh, I'll show you how easy it is in case you wanna do it yourself. All right. So this just unscrews, just like any bottle, and this whole thing comes out, right? So what you're gonna do is take this bottle, it tells you exactly how much on here if you read the directions. Um, if you open this up, and then when you squeeze the bottle, it comes up through this tube and fills this one. And then when you get the amount you want, it literally just dumps in, just like so. So then when you put a dose in there, throw the cap back on, and then what you'll do is fill the jug, there's a line right on here. You just fill it right up to there. Usually I give it a quick shake mix after we screw the top back on here. And then I'll show you how we pump it up. Alright, so I filled it up to the line. All you do is put this back in here like so. And then you screw it. And get it nice and tight. So just pump it up till you feel some pressure. And then you're just gonna lock it in there. And then if we test this out, you can see it here. You, just, you can carry it just like this. And you just give it a squirt. You can see how it's nice and pressurized. So I'm gonna fast forward you here, but I'll show you. First, we're gonna move the furniture out of the way. Obviously, you gotta move everything away from the concrete. I'm just gonna move it all out and then we'll go and just put go all along the back all along the stairs here and we'll do all the concrete right where the siding meets the concrete so just keep going along the concrete here get behind this situations like this you so just get down in here The idea, just like home defense, you're just trying to set up a perimeter all the way around everything. And that's what they stay away from. So, went all the way around the house. I get in the corners of the garage where they could possibly get underneath there. I usually do the perimeter of the garage too on the outside. Uh, and then what I'll do is come right around the house here. I'm gonna spray these four pillars for the patio and the perimeter of the patio around the outside edge by the grass keep them away from there and then the remainder i will use on the play set along the bottom of the play set to keep them from going up there and along the bottom of the shed 
So that's what we're gonna do for the spray. So I'll finish that up. I'm just mixing a second one right now and that should get me where I need to be. And then we'll come back and I'll show you the, the dust. So with the dust, it's pretty self-explanatory. I have the extending pole, um, but you could just use a regular wood painter's pole. This thread's on just like if you're familiar with the, the threaded pole that you use for rolling and stuff like that for paint. So the idea of this is literally all you want to do is just sprinkle some of this on here, like so, and like get right in there. And you're just gonna take this right up in the soffits. See if I can show you. And you're just gonna get up in here, just like that. See how the dust is going around. So you're just gonna do that all the way around the soffits. I'll get up all in here and just do the whole perimeter of the house. So as you can see with this extended one, it's real nice because you can reach way up high. And get right up in the, right up in the soffits with it. So all you're trying to do is just get dust in all the uh, crevices. So I like to run up and down the corners, all around the gutters, the windows. Just make sure you got some of this dust all up in there. So I'm just gonna continue going around the house, get as high as I can with the extended pole around all the corners and all the soffits. And then we'll be done. All right guys, so that's about it. Keep adding dust to this go around all the soffits, all the corners, all the lights, anything you don't want them to, to get to. Do the whole perimeter around the house, all the concrete, including the garage area, and you're good to go. It takes about 45 minutes for a good size house, and you won't have to worry about any spiders because they won't, they won't come on your patio, they won't come up the house because they don't, they usually come out of the grass. So if there's stuff along the bottom here, they won't come up the concrete, it's all covered. And it lasts pretty good with the rain, like I said, I get about six months out of it. I do it twice a year, so you can't really complain with that. But I'll leave a link to the description if you want in the, for their website. You can check them out. I'll see if I can get the exact link for this defense stuff. It's safe as soon as it dries. For the most part, it's safe. Everything's on the label. You can read it. The only one thing I did find was something about in New York City. They were using it, and I guess for cats, it's a little tricky. There's something about cats, not dogs, I guess, but with cats, I guess it can hurt them. So if you have any cats that roam outside, that might be an issue. You can use it inside, I guess, from what I read. I haven't had to because this usually keeps all the spiders out from the house. So, But I guess if you wanted to, you could, uh, you could use the dust or the spray inside. But that's about it. Hope you enjoyed this video. I'll make sure you check every, uh, out my other videos and uh, Instagram, Facebook. I'm subscribed to the channel if you want to see more. I got a bunch of stuff coming up. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, guys.